their true believers. Watch as once again, frightening forces are at work in our world, ready to wreak havoc with our very existence. Who or what prowls the halls of Empire State University after dark? None other than the master of illusion himself, the menacing Mysterio. <sighs> the tablet of order and chaos. Selling you on the black market is gonna make me a mint. Good, you can use a mint. I can smell your breath from here. Spider-Man! Wait, how would you eat a mint through that fishbowl? Nice! Don't get me wrong, your illusions are nifty, but if you ask me, they could use a little more kick. <laughs> Nah, uh Souvenirs are available in the gift shop. Stop it! Cease your incessant prattling! But incessant is the best kind of prat. What? What's this? Hey, Bubblehead! Think fast! <laughs> Okay, can somebody tell me what's going on here? Spider-Man, you are needed. Madam Webb? As if this night wasn't strange enough already. The Tablet of Order and Chaos is the most powerful of all the mystic artifacts in the world. And you shattered it. Yeah, sorry about that. Guess they don't make tablets like they used to, huh? The pieces are now fragmented across other dimensions. Dimensions that are strange reflections of our own. A past unlike ours. A present day out of sync. And a distant future which may or may not come to pass. Is that a... cartoon pig? Focus! I require your help. Yours and the help of these three other Spider-Men. The heroes into whose realities the tablet fragments fell. Whoa, whoa, slow down. Other realities? Other me's? Yes, I have explained our dire situation to them. They will be your allies in this quest. But I'm the most charming, right? You must gather all the pieces of the tablet before they fall into the wrong hands. Or our reality, as well as theirs, will be utterly destroyed. Yeah, yeah right. No pressure or anything. <laughs> Let's get started. These neighborhoods aren't gonna friendly themselves. If you follow my instructions, I will assist you in finding a fragment now. Who am I to refuse a lovely lady? Lead on, MW. I am augmenting your spider sense. Now, instead of just detecting danger, you have the added abilities of seeing through objects, locating enemies, and discerning structural weaknesses in your environment. Cool. We'll bestow it upon the other Spider-Men as well. Don't let weak structures or other obstacles block your path. Use your webbing to pull that wall down. And that's called breaking and entering. Hey, look what I found. Excellent work. A job well begun is half done. Now to another Spider-Man, and to bestow a different gift upon him. The black suit! What am I doing in the black suit? I, I hate this thing! Stay calm, young Peter. This suit has extra abilities you will need in your quest. What, like what? Trying to take over my body? I said stay calm. My psychic powers will keep it from overwhelming you. Yeah? Well, I hope you get the result. Now let's retrieve the next fragment. Spitzbot! The fragment is at the end of the corridor. Can you swing across to it? Can I? Lady, it's my trademark. They're all gonna be this easy to find, right? No. But now, I must turn my consciousness to the future and to... Miguel O'Hara, Spider-Man of the year 2099. That's me, ready to save the universe and looking good while doing it. The next fragment is close. Just ahead, in fact. I'm on it. 
Gotta watch out, though. This area is property of the Alchemax Corporation, and that means the public eye will be everywhere. And what, pray tell, is a public eye? Not a what, a who. The police force owned by Alchemax, and I'm not sure which is more corrupt. Speak of the devil. Here comes the public eye now. Many enemies will try to stop you from collecting fragments. You must defeat them in combat. Tell me about it. I tried to defeat him in cards once. It didn't go so good. Oh no! I didn't mean to make him disappear. You didn't. I have saved him from peril and transported him to safety, thanks to a dimensional rift caused by the tablet. But please, try not to be so cavalier next time. Good to know you got my back. Guess I'll just worry about my front. Beware, Spider-Man. Here come the last three. Take them out howsoever you choose. And make it good. You are one bloodthirsty old chick. I like it. Get him! warm-up, so when do I get a real challenge? I fear it will be sooner than you think. And finally, I turn my attention from the future to a world set in the past. Say your prayers, punks. Here comes the Spider-Man. What do we got here? Looks like criminal forces in this world have already found one of the fragments. They've taken over the station. And this used to be such a nice place. Use the shadows to your advantage. See if you can subdue these opponents silently with stealth attacks. You read my mind, sister. Yes, that's what I do. Those typewriters are slinging me no joke. Won't last long if they open up on me. Agreed. If an enemy spots you, it is imperative to defeat him quickly or retreat, either into the shadows or high above. I have gifted you with new web-swinging powers. They will be useful in this respect. Oh, I like this. Thanks for the enhanced powers, lady. The webs normally just kind of splatter everywhere. Use your spider sense to locate the fragment. <clears throat> There, through that gate. And that's the end of that. No, Spidey, it's just the beginning. Across many dimensions, these four fearless Spider-Men, in all their various incarnations, must fight to reassemble the Tablet of Order and Chaos. Not just for the sake of their own worlds, but for the fate of every world in every dimension. Good luck, Web Slingers. We're all counting on you. You've recovered the first quarter of the Tablet. Excellent. I've always been good at scavenger hunts. Like moths to a flame, those with evil hearts will be drawn to the unleashed power of the tablet, gaining new and frightening powers. So far, you have been fortunate that none of them have fallen into enemy hands. Why'd you have to go and say that? Man, what a jinx. Ah, useless hunk of nothing. Wait, what's this? Ah, yes, power. This is what real power feels like. No more parlor tricks and sleight of hand. Mysterio is now the master of real magic. And this is just the beginning. <laughs> Well, what do you know? I swing around long enough, and my new upgraded spider sense points me towards a fragment. Definitely sensing something from inside the, uh, jungle room? Hey, look at that! 
If it isn't Mr. Tablet Fragment, right there waiting for me to grab it. Which can only mean one thing. It's... Oh! Trap! Gotcha! That wasn't so bad, actually. Oh, come on! Rest now, my brain. Say a little strength. For when you awake, we begin the hunt. <laughs> Maniac. Where is he taking me this time? What horrible death trap will I have to overcome? Hey, this is a pretty nice view, actually. Welcome, Spider-Man. Welcome to the jungle. This rock, it holds great power, no? I could use it to crush you, like a bug. That wouldn't be very sporting of you, would it? Ah, you speak a great truth. Let it be your prize, then, if you can survive my gauntlet. Your powers against my skills. Your brain against mine. Come, enter my game of death. Claim your trophy, if you dare. Come, my friend. Do not delay. The Grim Hunt begins. Hurry! Hurry! So you want me to run through the jungle? Should I go back? Do not mock me, Spider-Man! Wow, you're awfully touchy for a guy who wears leopard print pants. Keep your tights on, I'm coming. Yes, there is much for you to experience here. Traps, long-range weapons. And of course, hand-to-hand -hand combat. How cute! You put together your own boy band. My disciples. They've come to study at the foot of the master to learn the art of the hunt from the greatest hunter of all. And the most modest. You dare talk me in front of my students? No, in front of your boy band. Men, remember what I have taught you. Strike hard, strike fast, and show no mercy. Yeah, let's see if you've got what it takes. You're in luck! This is Get Acquainted with Spider-Man Day. Bad guy, corner pocket. I'm Spider-Man, that's what I do. I break pots. Anybody else? It seems my men have not proved much of a challenge for you. Are you kidding? Those guys were brutal. I barely survived. Really? No. Come! The jungle still holds many surprises. I'm sorry, were you saying something? Wait for him to come within range. When you have the shot, Take it! I guess this begins the bullet dodging portion of the festivities. Next! Spider sense. Fiery Spear. Point taken. Another boy band? Are you guys gonna sing for me? Yikes! Don't think it's gonna work. Hmm, gonna have to find another way. Oh, come on! Sorry, I'm allergic to bullets. They ruin my complexion. Ah, you cannot dodge forever. Ooh, ooh, is this a private fight, or can I join? I have you in my sights. Girls, take that! There, and now... Ah, now not the beast! Get, get, get! Oh. 
Test my patience! You're out of here! Can you dodge this time? Garces! You test my patience! Can you Stop hitting your face with my fist! Guys, I've had a wonderful time, but this wasn't it. Let me guess. Two men enter, one man leaves. Am I right? Wow, love your headdress. Is that from the Skull Collection? May I suggest an accoutrement? Perhaps something from the Webbing Collection. Ha! Ah, classic. <laughs> Next time I play basketball, you will be on my team. Take a load off. Still he lives. I thought I taught you better than that. I promised to show you a true heart. I promised you a victory. And I am a man of my word. And now, the end. Game. He's blinded by the thrill of the hunt. Wait for him to lunge, then strike. Doesn't that outfit chase Let us not delay. Not now, when the blood bounds. Strike! Grievous will be victorious. No, you cannot. I have underestimated you. I will destroy you, Spider-Man! Holy cow, that worked. All right, uh, let's find Craven. My man has abandoned me because of you. You made a mockery of my teachings. It wasn't so much a mockery as a complete shambles. I have failed. And now I have nothing left. No dignity. No honor? Sergei, don't do something you're gonna regret. Nothing to stop me from using this. Great, you did something I'll regret. <laughs> Whoa, where'd he... Right behind you. Oh, such power. I have the speed of the tiger, the strength of the lion, and like the great cats, I shall play with my prey.
He's too fast. Wait for him to prepare his attack. This is an attack. Now die. You must try harder than that. I slice you. You must be faster, my friend. Too easy to dodge. Just in time. If I never hear the word hunt again, it'll be too soon. Now to the other fragments. Hunt resumes. Night on the waterfront. On the docks, rats scurry about their grim business. A tip from Felicia Hardy brought me here. Looks like she was onto something. Whoa, it's slipping! Hey, look at this. It's just a hunk of rock. What's all the extra protection for? The goblin paying you to ask questions now? No, Hammerhead. Then shut up. Goblin says the spider's coming after the tablet, and he wants all measures taken to stop him getting it. I'm flattered. Now load it in before I lose my cool. Oh, you're gonna lose your cool, all right. It's him, the Spider-Man! Then stop gawking and start throwing lead! I think we lost him. Keep your eyes peeled. You see something, shoot first and ask questions. Never. We're not taking any chances. Read me? Loud and clear, boss. Welcome, boss. We got everything set up for you. Save it, Montana. No time for gab. I got a real important delivery from Mr. Roswell. That's right. And I'm gonna follow you right to him. Too many Tommy guns for my taste. Better hug the shadows for now. Unless I want to get filled full of holes. Montana, you're with me. We got business to do. You and you, watch my back while we're on. Savvy? Right, boss. Right, boss. An ox. Yeah, boss? Stand there and look stupid. From what I can see, you have a lot of practice. All right, you mutts, listen up. Osborne wants us to be always knows what's best, doesn't he, fellas? <laughs> yeah, that's right. Let's get to it. Let's go. Get this open. That's one of the train yard workers. What's this all about? What? Why are you doing this? Let's just say I don't want anyone sticking their web nose in my business. If the Spider-Man tries to pull a rescue, we grease the stooge. Savvy? <laughs> yeah, boss. Good. Let's go. He shouldn't have brought innocent people into this. That just makes me mad. So what is this thing Osborne's having you deliver? What <laughs> Powers. How do you know? How do I explain it? Like, like all my books, you know? Like <laughs> speaks to him. Like, like a dame. I don't know what I don't know. Who in the What are you looking at? Nice looking at me like I'm not. He's not the only one. What do I pay you? Yes, sir. Christmas? You see this? That's all the right I keep, pal. Anyone else tries to get through, you swear to work. Get me? Yeah, boss. You can count on me. I'm all you. Cut the balloons, you say, get me. You guys go over there and keep it. You can't keep me here! Lights out! 
So where'd you get that hunk of rock? Jersey. Fell out of the sky on an explosion of light lands in Grover's Mill. Osborne hears about it from some of our boys here, sends me out to fetch it. You don't sound so happy. No? Listen to my voice. The boss tells me to do something like you. I ask him my opinion, he tells me. He wants me to be his little errand boy. I'll deliver. He's got Osborne pulling strings. I've got a floating head lady. I'm starting to wonder which one of us is more of a puppet. So Osborne. Osborne's working for his nerve. He's got me, Hit. Vulture, all of us bosses collecting these fragments. Running errands for him like bad boys. What though? If Osborne thinks he's the only one who can do this. I resent that. You can't keep me! Don't tell me you haven't killed him yet. He, he, he's been tearing the place apart, uh, freeing the hostages, ripping the gates up, knocking out the guys. That's so. Holy... Oh, told him not to tell me. All right now, time to step it up. Spider! You out there? You hear me? Hear this. It's war now. After tonight, you're gonna need a pallbearer. And I'll be at your service. You two stay put. They'll be coming through here after me. Your job is to stop them. And if you don't, you'll wind up like that chuck. Believe it. Where, where are you going? Me? that I don't have total faith in you, but I don't. Whoa! You think you can take me? Come on and have a go if you think you're hard enough. Hey, Spider. Wanna go a few rounds? Trust me, it'll only take one. Always got to attack from the back. I am covered. Here comes a little Chicago. I'm going to put you in a wooden kimono. No more. Please, please. I give, I give! Had enough, huh? Now hand over that rock! Sucker. Oh, cheap shot! See that sourpuss Hammerhead is sporting? I ain't seen a Batman since he caught Snake Boston pulling his contortionist act with Janice Boswell. You heard about the fancy dad? Fancy Dan, the ladies' man? I found him in a garbage can. Oh, man. Fancy Dan. And along comes the spider. I had a feeling you'd make sure of work at those other jerks. This might be a little more difficult for you. Five of my best trigger men, five hostages. And you're such a bleeding heart, you want to rescue them, won't you? <laughs> Good luck. My boys spot you, even for a second, and you'll wake up in hell. You're a pip, Hammerhead. Sayonara, creep. <laughs> a floating head lady sure walked me into it this time. Gotta grab the shadows and make my play. Take these palookas down one by one. The train yard. Normally this place would be alive with the sounds of working men doing honest labor. Tonight, it's a den of thieves. You want this tough guy? Come and take it. Just you and me. Mano a mano. That suits me fine. Finish him, boys! You miserable lying snake!
Time for some razzle dazzle. Say that was your best guy? What else you got? Nuts to this. Let's beat it. Right behind you. Yeah, run away. You idiots! You're all worthless! I'm coming for you, Hammerhead. Time for that mano a mano we talked about earlier. <laughs> show cards. Only one more left to play now. The power of the fragment. I should have used this rock sooner. First, I'll get rid of you. Then, I'll get rid of Osborne. I'll own this town. Ready for a real fight, tough guy? Mister, I was made for it. <laughs> <laughs> Anyone ever tell you how clever you are? No? Well, there's a reason. You're a real piece of work. Spider-Man, the floating head lady appreciates your assistance. <laughs> yeah, uh, sorry about that. This new spider sense is a trip. Either I'm not used to it yet, or I'm sensing one of the fragments closing in on me. Nope, I was right. Well, at least I found it. Ah, uh, 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 Spider. Don't fade on me yet. What are you supposed to be? The demonic kumquat? You can call me the Hobgoblin! Every Spider-Man needs one. Newsflash, Hobby. You're not my first goblin. Ah, but this goblin has one thing the others never had. The fragment! Yes, and with its power, I'm going to tear this world apart! <laughs> on that. Oh, do you love to know? Yeah, that's why I asked. Scared to face me, eh? I love seeing things burn. <laughs> <laughs> 
Everything seems slower. This will definitely come in handy. The shock. Here's some of you. Hey, can I call a timeout? Pumpkin bombs, pumpkin bombs, pumpkin. I've had it with this jabbering freak. anybody a freak, but that guy is a freak! All units, fugitives last spotted at platform 2. Could be headed this way! Could be! Look out, it's him! You're not like the other goblin I fought. Who are you? Where'd you come from? Not yet, Spider. Why spoil the mystery? skydiving routine. Oh, and just when you were getting warm. We'll have to continue this discussion later. Permission to use lethal force granted. Along came the spider and meet up some I've had it with this jabbering freak. Ruin all my fun! Hey, someone's gotta do it. Why don't we meet up top? I've heard the view is to die for! And don't wait on my account. If I'm not there in five minutes, start beating yourself up without me. Don't take this the wrong way, but the more I get to know you, the less I like you. Oh, but there's so much more to learn about me! Take my psi powers, for instance! Not bad, eh? Let's see what happens when I add a fragment's power to the mix. What's happening? of these flying creatures as soon as you can. Hey, why'd everybody fall asleep on me? You have a fire The old you wouldn't like when I can.
I'm sorry, I can't hear you over all the crazy! Why don't we go for a ride? And not a moment too soon. You said it, Webb. Now, let's take a better look at these. Looks like nanofibers fused with bioorganic circuitry. Only one corporation has technology advanced enough for this. Alphans. What is that weird smell? Oh, right. Fresh air. Wish I could enjoy being out of the city, but that suit is throwing me. I feel dirty, and not in a fun, let's go clubbing way. Okay, gotta focus. That magic rock's around here somewhere. And I just figured out where. Ah, oh, if it isn't the spectacular spider smut. Oh, dude, pants. No one wants to see your junk. Keep laughing, punk. See what I found? What do you think happens if I use it? Uh, interest rates go down? Yes. It's like my powers are totally unleashed. Now I can absorb all this energy. Energy without limit! And yet, still no pants. See what I can do now? I am so impressed. I've never seen anyone start a truck before. Laugh it up! Last chance to run! I want about this! What the? Impressive, huh? Little versions of you? I think the word is creepy. Time to call on the cavalry! Oh. You can't keep up. I'm moving at the speed of my... Hey, you got a license for that? Ah. Water pump! More people to save. All in a heroic day's work. Okay, doors open, Spider-Man! Good work. Ah, that is the spot. Yeah, baby! Like that, right there! Uh, ew! Do you and your generator, like, need some time alone? Let's get this party started. Oh, you can turn this place into a disco. Classy. I thought heroes were supposed to stand and fight. A tough oh. run. Oh. You want a piece of me? We're really sparking off each other here. We're really sparking off each other here. Die, loser! Booyah! Oh. Ever told you how impressive you are? Because if they did, they were lying. Take that! You're gonna get oh Surprise! in your face! <laughs> ah, you can feel I feel so. <laughs> you think you're so hot, don't you? Actually, now that you mention it. Well, guess what, Twerp? That's just one of the generators in this joint. And the more of them I drain, the stronger I'll get. Get off me, you little freaks! Oh man, I knew this would happen. It's a suit. 
I gotta get it off me before I... Gotta get my rage off! wearing any pants, so two steps forward, one step back. Electro is even more powerful now. Strike when his energy field is down. Whoa! You must be really terrified of me. <laughs> I don't blame you. Here we go. Again. <laughs> <laughs> Just how I like it. I thought heroes were supposed to stand and fight. I cut and run. Take it. Look out! <laughs> Gotta charge up. This is impossible. I need to recharge. You know what I find helps? Rest and relaxation. Turn the TV off, just have a little me time. But that's spread out. Spider-Man, you must keep Electro from gaining more access to power sources. I already knew that. Perhaps. But you don't know the grave consequences you're facing for failing to stop him. Uh, worse than a little light show, huh? Much worse. Of course! Yes, yes, yes! Yes, yes, yes! Why don't you just give up a little? Never mind. But, you know, if you change your mind, giving up is still an option. I have become a being of pure energy! Without pants! Next! The city! All that power! Don't like the rain, huh? It's harmless! Like you! Let me see what I can do about that. On both counts. He is too powerful to take damage from you now. You must find another way to defeat him. You're about to get nice and toasty. That's it, sweet stuff. Come to Papa! Get that junk off of me! Uh-oh! Who's about to get fried? Juice me up! Don't make me laugh! Burn, baby, burn! <laughs> I'm a drop, you! I'm not taking any chances! I'm not taking any chances! Get ready for the breakdown! <laughs> Time to talk to the head! No, no, come on! Come, come on! No way! Not th Hey, big guy! Drinks are on me! Oh! The water! It's taking me apart! You seem shocked? 
And that's why you never make toast in the bathtub. Congratulations, Spider-Man. You really showed him what's... what? Wah, wah. Mysterio was dangerous enough before, when he was a simple charlatan. Imagine what he might become, with even more magical might at his command. Even I can't begin to fathom it, mighty Marvelites, and that's saying something. Yes, run! Run from your master, the almighty Mysterio! Oh, please! And for my next trick, I make two policemen disappear. Huh? More pieces of the tablet. That means more power. More. I must have them. Holy. Yeah, you said it. Gotta hurry up and find the next fragment. And there it is. So why is my spider sense tingling? Jeez, talk about a dirt nap. Where's the... Looking for this, webhead? Well, if it ain't my old pal, Flint Marco, the Sandman. You know, every time we play together, I end up digging sand out of my costume for weeks. I got a game for you to play. Marco? Marco? Polo! Oh man, and I thought my jokes were bad. Sandstorm powers. Yep, there's definitely gonna be sand in my costume after this. I gotta find some way to take the wind out of his sails. Maybe I can find something to stop him. That'll stop me! Think again! Yoink! Oh, look, you're all wet. Want me to go grab a towel? You're not going anywhere. I can control any sand I see now. Any sand at all! Yeah? You could make a killing in the landscaping business. I'll make a killing, all right! Oh, that's it. Punching Sandman will have no effect unless he is turned into mud. Bob. Gonna make you pay. Oh, you're so gay. Can't I got a better idea for how to deal with you. That's nice and ominous. Serious, do you consider it? Next! What's wrong? Moisturizing is supposed to be good for the skin. Where are you going now? Can I come? Huh? Huh? Can I? Oh, we're not going into the spooky old mine, are we? Will we have to solve a mystery and unmask someone dressed as a ghost, too? If so, my money's on old man Jenkins. Okay. I've seen enough scary movies to know that this is the moment when the monster jumps out. I knew it! Ugh, my head.
dead. I'll kill you! No, thanks. I think that would make it worse. You will need a great deal of water to stop him this time. Okay, thanks, buddy. What's around here you can use against him? <laughs> You're digging your own grave, Spidey. If it's water, it'll hurt him. Same. <laughs> in your eye. Ah! Don't leave me alone in here. This place is scary. Look at it. I think your walls are starting to crumble in more ways than one. Nice place, but I wouldn't want to live there. Again with the tornado? This trick didn't stop me last time, and it won't stop me now. I'm warning you, wall crawler. Yeah, but you're all hot air. Give up. Slow down. It's hard to understand you when you talk over yourself. Ashes to ashes, and uh, sand to sand. Ah! that doesn't get sucked into the tornado. Is that too much to ask? Destroy you! Not serious. Have you considered therapy? Back to the old salt mines. Literally. Hmm, sand. He must have gone through this wall. <laughs> And they say I'm not a detective. That drill could probably make Swiss cheese of it, but its operator must have run off as soon as- Help! Somebody help me! I'm being attacked by sand creatures! Mm, uh huh That drill may be the only way out. We're through! Nice. One thing I can say about you, pal. You know the drill. First time I saved a superhero! Thanks for the drill. I won't call you when I need a filling. You can't stop me now, Redhead. I've spread my mind too far. Farther than ever. I know. I am everywhere! <laughs> yeah, I'm really happy for you, but talking to everywhere and nowhere at the same time is kind of distracting. Why don't you just show your- This is gonna be close. Whoa! <sighs> I am not going on that ride again anytime soon. Okay, maybe I should head for cover before Sandman- Yikes! Nowhere to go! <laughs> End of the line for you, Spider Punk. I'll finish you. Kill him now? No. Play with him a while. Don't give him a chance to escape. I want to make him suffer. Make it last. No. Do it now. Kill him. Flint, your consciousness can't handle being spread this thin. The fragment has made you too powerful. You would say that. Wait. What if he's right? No, it's a trick. It's not a trick. I can feel it! Shut up! Admit it! He's right! He's lying! Shut up! All of you, just shut up! Quiet! Use the water barrels amongst the debris to your advantage. Use the 
water barrels amongst the debris to your advantage. Water barrels. Help me! Well, it wasn't exactly a day at the beach, but it was worth it. And now to clean the sand out of my shorts. Humans around for dinner? You can't escape me, coward! Spider-Man is coming, and I want him dead, understand? <laughs> More vultures trigger men. Spider-Man is after me! Don't worry, Mr. Toomes. He drops in, he gets lead poisoning. Vulture's flown the coop again, but he's not getting away. Not for me. You can run, Vulture, but you'll never escape me. Looks like I got the drop on you. Hey guys, don't suppose I can get a glass of milk? Sorry, pal, but I got something here that'll get you good and hammered. I've seen smaller elephants. By unanimous decision, the Spider-Man! Creepier than usual. Yeah, and that's saying something. I didn't think anything could scare him. He's usually the scariest thing around. His breath always stinks, too. Yeah, what's that guy eat? <sighs> Never seen Vulture like that. He was sweating bullets. Yeah, and anything that scares a guy like that scares me. The spider wants to muscle in on this action. He's messing with the raw gang. I'll fill him full of daylight. <laughs> It's nighttime. Same principle. It doesn't sound as good, though. A film full of nighttime? Exactly. See, this is why we're just goons. Because we have stupid discussions like this. Reinforcements, huh? I'll take down every thug in this town if I have to. Who else wants some? That's enough of it. 
kiss that dirt. Merrier. You're all about to get screwed speechless. Finally. I'm closing in on him. I can feel it. If I know Vulture. He'll go higher and higher, like a bird. Oh, no. <laughs> wakey, wakey, eggs and bakey. Care for a drink? Welcome to hell! My god, there are other people in here. You maniac! What have you done? Gotta save them. Down. 
late! Vulture! Where are you, you piece of trash? in the vicinity report to 121st and Lex. One of those fragments Alchemax is looking for has been found. Units 94 and 98 en route. All units be advised. Alchemax warns that the fragment may attract freakers or other... What is that thing? Don't move! Hands where I can see them! Ah! That can't be good. Kron Stone. I didn't even like this guy when he was human. Uh-huh. You didn't say the magic word. May I please have the... Die! Don't shake your tail at me when I'm talking to you. Security breach. Security breach. The Dude Fairy's about to get real busy. <laughs> Makes everyone seem slower. This is definitely coming in. Promised. Promised. I heard something. Cover me. What the freak are these? Stay back. You don't know what. Breach warning, Sector 84. Available units to Sector 84. Alarm. Now. We will hurt others if followed. How can I get those doors open and follow Scorpion? I bet those scientists can help me. Okay, this is getting twisted. The doors are working savage. No! And stay down! Get those things out of here so we can work in peace! 
stop me. I can't keep working like this. They're out of control. Keep them off us. We'll get the doors open, but not like this. I don't know about you, but I'm having a blast. Who's sign up for this? I think we finally got it. Good work. You have done it. Scorpion, I want that fragment. No! You don't understand the power in that thing. It's dangerous. See, see this? I'm dangerous. Monster! She promised. She who? Who promised? Kron, listen to me! No, you listen! Smart ladies should get rock! Bring her rock! Promised! Make me human again! Human! Who? What lady? No! a little on the freakish side, but I'm a freak too. I mean, look at me. I'm lucky I don't shoot webs out of my butt. Who is she, Kron? 
Who put you up to this? This is bigger than either of us. Congratulations, Spider-Man. You've retrieved another fragment. This day is yours. Yeah? Then how come I feel so bad about it? Pain Factor! With your host, the anti-hero for hire, the mask for your task, the guy who won't die, Deadpool! Hi, Ma, and welcome to Pain Factor, the only show where you compete for your life! And remember, viewers, I'm available for Black Ops missions, assassinations, and birthday parties. I don't know what's weird, that this guy can somehow come back from the dead, or that they gave him a TV show. Coming up, we've got a very special pain factor, with a very special guest running the gauntlet. Who? You, Spider-Man! Wait, w what? That's right! Our guest today will be the one, the only, the friendly neighborhood Spider-Man! Because he needs this. Television, you are a cruel mistress. You know, you can run inside. Wow, that's not too big or anything. Can somebody say overcompensating? Spidey! Can I call you Spidey? Hey, thanks so much for being part of our little webisode. Because <laughs> because you shoot the web. Okay, hey, can I get you anything before we start? Soda, bottled water? How about the fragment? <laughs> okay, good one. Okay, here we go. Picture up in three. And welcome, welcome, welcome to Pain Factor! Is there a mute button for him? And here he is, the terrifying, the deadly, the amazing Spider-Man! Just what I always wanted, a tasteful introduction. Not a bad entrance. Mine's gonna be better, though. Hey! That was a live feed you just killed! Now what am I gonna tell its folks? <laughs> Tell them it was a mercy killing. If they've seen your show, they'll understand. Listen, Webby, I can't have you swinging around in your footy pajamas destroying my cameras. You're gonna have to tangle with my army. And by army, I mean production assistants. And by production assistants, I mean unpaid interns. And by unpaid interns, I mean fans. You're gonna have to tangle with my fans. Lamest supervillain ever.
I could do this all night! Come on, like I wouldn't have a backup plan? This is live TV, baby! The show must go on! Spider-Man! You're the next contestant on The Priceless Fight! Come on down! Let's see what you want! A ridiculously big enemy to fight! That's a prize? Uh-oh! Looks like the spider's about to get squished! And we're out of the commercial. Yeah, but huh? Don't worry, we'll pick it up in the same spot when we come back. Guys, get down there and keep the talent limbered up in the meantime. Let's do and this! Now a word from our what? Looks like the spider's about to get squished! Go get him, Beauregard! Beauregard? You're so small! Punchy punch! punch. Welcome to the Wadey Wilson Show. Today's guest, Spider-Man. Hey, buddy, MC. Let's talk about the question on everyone's lips. How hot is Kenny Pride? Oh! Almost as hot as that redhead I always see you say. Do I sense a bit of a love to wrangle there? Come on, get out of here. And is it true there's a clone of you out there with your brain, but trapped inside a girl's body? Because <sighs> that's kind of like... And by kind of, I mean insane. You're wrecking my show! Congratulations, Spider-Man! You've ruined my broadcast and you deserve your prize. The fragment? That won't do! Bad Spidey! Bad! <sighs> oh, my head. Where am I? Yoo-hoo! Watch me, Mommy! Watch me! Ta-da! Live and in person, the one, the only, Deadpool! Oh, look at you. What about me? I thought you'd be taller. I... Oh, well, we just won't use a lot of wide lenses. Deadpool! Thank you, thank you. Don't throw flowers, just send money. Don't take this the wrong way, but you seem a couple pieces short of a pot. What did I do in a past life to deserve this? <laughs> Guns don't kill people, I kill people! It's <laughs> life to deserve this. <laughs> like, I'm really impressed with so much of that you're not. What a close. This is my job. Coward, just because I was whipping your hiney. I'm not running away. I'm just gonna go find a dictionary so I can look up sniveling. Sniveling. <laughs> hiney. Come on, I'm ready. That's my rod. You better fail. <laughs> well, my little petunia, it's been fun. For me, I mean, not so much for you. Whoa! Okay, that was an experience. Hey, man, love your outfit. Back at ya! You get yours from the fan club catalog, too? Nah, the gift shop. You know, if you get it in person, they actually tailor it for you. No way! Right there in the shop? Yeah, well, I mean, they take your measurements there in the shop. But doing the actual tailoring takes a couple days, but it's so worth it. Yeah, I was gonna say! I mean, right? Dude, 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 turn around. Let me look at how it fits you. Yeah, I gotta say, that is really nice. I'm telling you, man, tailored. 
These cameras are his eyes and ears. Better not go. <laughs> Welcome back to the Waiting Wilson Show with our special guest, Walter Webbs. Now, Walter, let's talk about that time you and Wolverine switched brains. <laughs> Actually, I've got a question for you then. Where'd you get that fragment? I'm really glad you asked. The answer to the question is... Get it! Congratulations! For surviving this long, you've received the Pain Factor Home Game! Now you can risk your well-being and sanity for the entertainment of others in the comfort of your own home. Follow me to pick up your prize. Can the prize be stuffing a sock in your mouth instead? Did you seriously just try to lock me in a room? What am I, grounded? Just sit tight, my little mouth breather. We gotta pause for another break from our sponsor. There is a world of spirits, unseen by most, but just as real as our own. And when you need a guide to penetrate its mysteries, you know who to call. <laughs> Highs in the mid 60s and a low of 75. On the bad news tip, viewers are advised to seek higher ground because we're about to have a massive tidal wave tear through here. Looks like it'll be caused about five seconds from now by some nutty feather plucker detonating a whole mess of explosives underwater. Of course, the question on everyone's lips is who would be crazy enough to. Oh, wait, it's me! It's a good start for Swingin' Spider, who quickly claims the inside, joined now by Rising Waters. Certain death is up the third, followed by Soggy, Corpse, and Force. But on the outside, moving up fast is Tidal Wave. Tidal Wave making his move as they come down the stretch with an eighth of a mile. Unbelievable! He deserves it. And it's Swingin' Spider after a bad start, followed by Shake Thumb and Sweaty Controller. But what's this? Moving up fast on the outside, gonna fail this level! It's Swingin' Spider, Shaky Thumb's gonna fail this level, Sweaty Controller, it could be anything! find me this annoyingly talkative? Uh, don't answer. All right, ugly McEvilstein, you're about to get canceled. And cut. That's a wrap. Great show, everybody. Great show. Here you go, kid. You earned it. Uh, thanks. Hey, fair is fair, right? BTW. What's the big deal with that thing, anywho? Well, it's a long story. Basically, it gives bad guys extra superpowers, so I have to... Wait a sec. This is a prop. Oh, candy bar. I'm gonna get a candy bar. Snap. Crackle chop! I love this! Finally, someone to laugh at my jokes! Hey, what's green and makes noise? What? The incredible honk! <laughs> Kill him! Kill him! Kill him! Yes! A totally honking honk! Oh, he put up a fight! Here it comes! Level up! Who missed me? Level up! Quick question. Boxes or briefs? Party poppers, you can Right in the cage. 
Deadpool, go to bed school. It's like I just ate a whole can of spinach! <laughs> We'll be right back after these messages. Another successful mission. You get a high rating. Aren't they all? Um, just one thing. How do I get home? So far, so good. Our web slingers have triumphed over unbelievable odds. But there are still more pieces of that terrifying tablet out there. And something tells me the worst is yet to come. And voila! Excellent work, Spider-Man. Who says good help is hard to find? Now, just one more fragment to go, and look out! The rest of the tablet will be mine. It must be mine. You again? Why don't you go saw a lady in half or something? Hey, that was no illusion. You've underestimated me for the last time, Spider-Man. And this old crone will pay for your insolence. Recover the rest of the tablet for me, or this will be the last you see of her. Ah! Stop. I'll do it. Just don't hurt her, okay? Hurry, spider. The clock's ticking. <laughs> All right. Somewhere in this giant construction yard is the next fra... Oh, well, this is a little too easy. Why did I say that? Out of my way! Juggernaut. Yeesh, could things get any worse? Die. Did it again, didn't I? Give up, Juggernaut! Silver Sable's on your tail! Get lost! <laughs> Not a chance, Marco. My wild pack can track your every move. And for the bounty that's on your head, we follow you to the ends of the Earth. Eh, I think I'll just let them play through. All I care about right now is that frag- Oh, come on! Juggy must have picked it up somehow, and he's probably too stupid to even realize it. Can't let Sable take him in before I get that fragment. All right, Spidey, think. Sable said something about tracking him. Ah. This will buy me a little alone time with Juggy. All units! Juggernaut is moving fast to the east! Don't let him get away! Great! Now it's just him and me. You! Great! Now it's just him and me. Once I get started, Oh, is that why they call you the Juggernaut? I totally get it. Here is your chance when he smashes the ground. Okay, Laughing Boy. Now hold still while I deliver the coup de gras. I hate French food. No, coup de gras. It means like. It means you're out of here. Well, I guess that's one interpretation. Spider-Man, what a pleasant surprise! There's a nice little yacht I had my eye on. The bounty on your head should just about cover the cost. I see where this is going. Me versus a lot of guys with guns, am I right? Package in all units. We have a new secondary target, Spider-Man. This is working out exactly the opposite of perfectly. First come, first serve. Ah! You're done. Juggernaut is cutting his thoughts from the east. Bravo one, cover me. We'll finish Spider-Man later. Whew, I thought they'd never leave. Out of my way, Rutz! Bullet Yates! It's Juggernaut! And you, you're going down the hard way! This is Bravo two, Juggernaut's on me! The assistance, repeat, the assistance! <laughs> So, 
just us, huh? Spider-Man's still a target! Get him! Oh, come on, really? Hold him, man, and I'll pound him! Ah! Now, how do I get out of here? Stop following me, wall crawler! Says the guy as he makes an opening. I believe it was Gertha who said, he who jealously guards his fears secretly yearns to bring them about. Either him or Irving Forrush. I'm gonna mop the floor with you! a guy pick a fight with a building and win. Man, did you see that? He brought down the whole building! Be impressed on your own time! After him! Sounds like they're going my way. Maybe I can snag a ride. Thanks for the ride, guys! Secondary target acquired! I have visual on Spider-Man! You have a visual on your face? Yeah, that sounded better in my head. How am I gonna get through that mess? I'm not Maybe if I help one of those workers, they can help me. There's a bounty on Spider-Man's head! Don't let him escape! Cover me! Spider-Man, am I glad to see you? I need your help with something. Okay. Yeah, sure, sure, whatever you need. Hey, do I get to spin some webs? No. Okay, well, whatever you need. You just name. Okay, we're good to go now. Finally. I'm glad they weren't eight. There's a freight I heard him. Oh. There's a freight I'd heard him. Juggernaut's been spotted at the Oscorp building. All units, engage. It's your luck. Gotta reach Juggernaut before Sable's thugs blast him and the Fragment to pieces. Moving on him! What's he doing? Shake him! Shake him up! Okay, we go! Look out! No! That's it. I'm ending this. Now! Better put some hustle in my bustle. That's what I do. Off my shoe once and for all. Hands off the helmet. Hands off the helmet. Let's get a good look at that gorgeous mug. Don't be so bashful. With a little makeup, you could really be quite average looking. Uh, still fighting? Survived that. 
Ta-da! This might be my only chance. I gotta get my hands on that fragment before he finds it. Hey, what's this glowing thing? Yeah, crumbs. I'm even more powerful than before! Are you also nicer? No, I gotta get me another one of these! I couldn't stop him before, and here he is more unstoppable. Fear not. The newfound power of the tablet seems to be at odds with his crimson gem. So with great power comes great vulnerability? Hey, if that's the case, I'll take it. Call me when you're ready to put up a fight! Blasted nuisance! There is still much to do. The old carnival. Osborne's camped out here somewhere in this rotted alley of nightmares. But I'll find him. Him and the fragments he's collected. He's after those rocks we've been bringing you. First, he got Bolcha and Hammerhead. And now he's headed here! I'm telling you, Mr. Osborne, the Spider-Man is coming. Do you take me for a fool? <laughs> what? I want him to come. Let the spider fall into my web. The other fragments made Hammerhead and Vulture more powerful. Let's see what this one does for me. <laughs> Tonight, your criminal empire ends. Welcome, Spider-Man. Look around. Know where you are. A demilitarized zone? The carnival where I once starred in the freak show many years ago. The perfect place to begin my revenge. Great idea. But when I came back, I had to relocate the current employees to more temporary lodgings. And I do mean temporary. I have this unfortunate tendency to kill things when I'm born. <laughs> You'll see. Wrong, Goblin. Because I'm going to find him. And I'm going to save him. Then I'm going to find you and put you down like the wild dog you are. And last but not least, I'm going to bring back the fragment. Starting now. <laughs> You're the best! Cheery. Abandon all hope, ye who enter here. You make it sound so in- Behold! The goblin in all his glory. Stronger. More powerful! And that hair, it's scarier than ever. I'll give you something to be scared of. Pathetic. 
Jack, and you thought you could beat me. Ha! Give it your best shot, then, if you can. Come and get your superior, the Goblin Victorious! <laughs> Seems the Goblin Victorious forgot to pay his electric bill. I think I know how to get- You're making this too easy for him. Thanks, pal. Now breeze off. Enter the haunted house! Welcome. Welcome to my house. Phew. All these grinning faces are creeping me out. It's like an advertisement for hell. No. Better try again. Fast. <laughs> Finally. Not so fast. I guess he, uh, oh, couldn't take what I was dishing out. I'll have my revenge! I'll tear this place down with my bare hands if I have to! Wait, he's not gonna... Is he? Could he? <laughs> he could, and he did. Oh no, help! Huh. He must have really hated that ride. Okay, wish me luck. What was that? Why do you begrudge me my revenge? Why do you begrudge me my revenge, you little insect? 
Do you know what I went through growing up in a cage? Children throwing sticks, women screaming at the sight of me. Who would deny me my vengeance against a world so full of hate? Only you. Are you gonna stand there babbling all night, or are we gonna end this? You! That's me. He's too powerful. You have no chance engaging him head on. I'll feed you. Where I can see. You must use the shadows to your advantage. Osborne is too powerful to fight directly. There, just the man I did. Scorpion was going to bring his fragment to someone here, at one of the high security labs. Luckily, my secret identity happens to work here. I know these security systems better than anyone. Except maybe whoever's collecting these fragments. Preliminary tests confirm what I've suspected from the beginning. That this artifact is an energy source of almost immeasurable power. Clearly, this calls for proactive measures. To prevent it from falling into the hands of... Rivals! Go, man! Busted! So, we finally meet. I'm Serena Patel, head of Alchemax's Shadow Division. Never heard of it. Yes, that's why it's called Shadow Division. Ah, touche. So, what's the master plan, Patel? You shadowy types always have one? Hmm, I could kill you, or I could explain everything and then kill you. I think I'll just kill you. Son of a... Computer, this laboratory has been compromised. Initiate self-destruct sequence. Ten seconds. Ten seconds? That's barely enough time to come up with a clever explosion-related quip. Ooh, that must really burn you up. So long, Spider-Man. It's been a blast. Ah, oh, she's good. Welcome to the Shadow Division, Spider-Man. Tomorrow's weapons develop today. And at the heart of it all, my masterpiece. Impressive, isn't it? Meh. What do you mean, meh? I've seen one of these before. No, you haven't. I have. I, I totally have. It's a condensed matter reactor, the only one in existence. Is that what it is? Oh. Meh. Maybe this will impress you. The power of a million thermonuclear reactions at my command. Now the world is mine. Everybody sing. Everybody praise me.
Just... ow. Okay, those cables gotta go somewhere. First step, figuring out where. I'm not scared of you. What? You're not getting it. Oh, I am good. Ooh, big blowy thing. Lost. Look at that! No more force field! But more speed. Ah! <laughs> Gimme! Three more to go. Here, let me open. Get a good shot at I've been working here for years, and I still can't believe that Alchemax just flat out ripped off the Avengers logo. You're not the first to try and stop me, Spider-Man. Even some of my subordinates have accused me of megalomania. And let me guess, you listen to their concerns calmly with an open mind. Not quite. That was my answer. Public Eye, we have an intruder at Lab 4. Uh, I missed you guys. All units, report to me now! Me? She's the crazy one. You realize that, right? You've discovered another one of my masterpieces. Enjoy beauty while you can. All units, attack! I must have fought half the police in the city by now. Get it! something so satisfying about this. Four will stop me. All you've done is ensure you're on the doom. Yeah, says you. Ah, oh, shit. Here's a shock to your sister. Good luck. Yeah. Don't mess up. Do you honestly think you can outrun an exotic energy wave? Do you honestly think you can outrun an exotic energy wave? Good work. You've done better than expected, but it ends now. I admire your persistence, Spider-Man, but it's taken you as far as you'll go. I admit, I'm impressed, but then I have low expectations. Two down, two to go. <laughs> Minor threat detected. Get him! Hang a load. Hallelujah. Another connection lost. I can't believe I've let you live this long. I'm warning you, Spider-Man. Give up now before I'm forced to destroy you! I'm a patient woman, Spider-Man, but my patience is at an end! Ooh, I'm really getting under your skin. I keep this up, you're gonna have a meltdown, aren't you? I won't. You will! Silence! One more to go. Let's try. 
try this again. Yeah, let's. You're gonna need the world's biggest sling because that arm's about to get broken. That's no good. Die! I crush you. joke. Oh, man, it's gonna be a good one, too. Well, at least the force field's down. That solves that. Hey, Spider-Man, follow me. I'll help you stop her. I'll lower the force field around the power core. Watch my back. Hold on. I'll deal with the security. Get it! Security! Where are you? Hey, she's the crazy one. You realize that, right? That ought to do it. Congratulations. You've shut down a number of redundant energy batteries. A minor inconvenience. As long as I have the artifact, my reactor is unstoppable. And the destruction I wreak with it will be a testament to its magnificent design. Really? Doesn't seem like much of a machine if it gets all its power from a magic rock. You creep! Do you have even the slightest idea what complicated engineering is required for it to successfully derive energy from a mystical artifact? Do you? Do you? Mm. I'll kill you! You must find a way to get her out of there. You must find a way to get her out of there. Don't mind my lasers. Nah, uh uh Surely you can do better than that. This might have hurt Die, Spider-Man! Your combat skills are effective. In a rudimentary. She's consuming a great deal of energy to get to you. Find a way to use that to your advantage. Let me show you what I'm capable of. Enough! You're an impressive specimen. I'll let you. Do good work. Don't let the bad men hurt you, my lovelies. What, they didn't have anybody bigger? Tear him to pieces, my darling.
I am incredible. Now, let's get this back where it belongs. Oh, great, just great. I figure why not swing by the Triskelion and see if I could get some help from Nick Fury or any of his S.H.I.E.L.D. agents. And this is what I find. Either something really big happened here, or Nick Fury has terrible taste in decoration. Red goop, the bodies drained to husks. There's only one thing that could do this. One thing. This prisoner, 900F, has escaped holding. All available security units to prison level. In the entire history of having bad feelings, the one I'm having right now is the worst. Explaining what the hell is going on? Carnage. Yeah, that much I got. No, that red monster, the clone, that's what we call him. Prisoner 900M, case designate Carnage. He escaped while, uh, we were studying him. I managed to lock him out of here, but then the agents he killed somehow reanimated themselves. He never had that kind of power before. Tell me this doesn't have anything to do with him being exposed to a mystical fragment. My god. How did you know? Oh, you stupid. We had to risk it. The energy readings we got when the two were in proximity suggested... Just open the door. You're... Wait. You're going in there after it? Why? Because great power comes with great responsibility. Something you wouldn't understand.
right, evildoers. Come to Spidey. Let's see, Spider-Man. I know the way out. This way, thank you. Looks like our way out. Hang on! <laughs> Thanks for getting me to safety. And good luck stopping us. You're gonna need it. You're good telling me. Good luck. I don't believe it. Is that a crashed helicarrier? mother with that mouth if you had a mother if there's a better example of why we have limits on human cloning I'd like to see it no on second thought I really, really I'll stop doing it as soon as you stop surviving <laughs> I keep hoping this is just the worst nightmare I've ever had in my life. In any way. Ever. Enough with the screaming! Mayday, Mayday! This is Helicarrier Dump Sierra. Can anyone hear me? Mayday! We're coming back in! Looks like he's heading for that control tower. Mayday! Smash the giant egg in the center of the room. Spider-Man, Spider-Man! If you can hear me, this is H. Dwelling of S.H.I.E.L.D. We're sending in new Slayer robots that have been programmed to recognize you as an ally. Look for the red ones! Well, what do you know? My very own robot sidekicks. I'll call this one Herbie. Big fella. Daring look you got going on there. You don't see many people these days wearing their muscles on the outside. And seen. That's gonna be Easter's early this year, boy! That's the 
daring look you got going on there. You don't see many people these days wearing their muscles on the outside of the... Webheads, they fought their way from one dimension to the next, faced a number of their most fearsome foes, and found the final fragments of the fabled Tablet of Order and Chaos. But they're not done yet. Remember, there's still a damsel in distress, so what are you waiting for, heroes? Hop to it! What now? I can't give the final tablet piece to Mysterio, but if I don't, it's lights out for Madame Webb. Think, Spidey, think. After years of pretending, of faking my way with special effects and stage magic. To have a taste of the real thing. <laughs> I can't wait any longer. Where is he? I want that tablet! Don't say I never gave you anything. The tablet, it's reassembling itself. Oh, great. Power! Beyond that of a god, the walls of reality crumble before me! Madam Webb, don't worry about me, Spider-Man. Look! The web of reality, the tapestry of the universe, is unraveling. Yes, a universe to remake in my image. I will devour every dimension until all is Mysterio! Last chance. With the walls of reality broken, I can summon your counterparts from the other worlds. The four of you, together, are reality's only hope. I command reality itself! Now you don't need to get a swelled head about it. Show off. And now I end you! Show off. Show off. I'm really dead. You will bow down before me. You're full of something. I'm tired of this game. I will. Christen my new dimension with your ashes. Really? Sounds fascinating. Tell me more. You will bow down before me. I'm real intimidated.
Behold, now the tiny spider stands against me. Hey, I'm sensitive about my height, okay? Here we go. Again. There is nothing I cannot summon! <laughs> Enough with the laughing already! You can have used my own creations against me! Again? You know, standing on solid ground is so 29. Uh, I grow weary of this battle. This should finish you. Listen to all you wannabe bad guys out there. When destroying dimensions and defying do-gooders, watch out.
because you might unleash forces beyond your control, like the palpable power of four sensational Spider-Men. Wait! Wait, the tablet! Oh, it could still be mine! It could still... Some guys never learn. And, uh, speaking of learning, you should learn how to count. Something tells me you're outnumbered. <laughs> Gentlemen. I really hate this fella. <laughs> Ah, come on, he's a blast to kick in the face. Pal, you got a shot. Well done. The walls of reality are rebuilding themselves. And now, you must all return to your own dimensions. See you later, older and less cool versions of me. Old? Hey, I'm from the future. To me, all you guys are ancient history. Good to know there is a future and men like you to carry on the good fight. Word. Bye, guys. Next time you should hang around longer. We could start a bridge club or something. Come on, Misty. Time to drop you off at Supervillain Daycare. Thank you, Spider-Man. You should be proud to know your legacy is being upheld across time and space. Yeah, those guys were all right. But you have to admit... With four different Spider-Men? The one thing I know for sure... Out of all of them? I'm the best! And so ends one of the most titanic team-ups of all time. And what have we learned here today, Marvelites? That no matter what corner of the cosmos you may find yourself in, there'll always be a friendly neighborhood Spider-Man to save the day. And to all of you web-spinning wonders, I proudly say, Excelsior! <laughs> what I miss? What the? Nuff said, kids. Nuff said. like you call me.
I keep trying to tell myself that I'm just jealous of Walker Sloan's progress. It was only five years ago that he first showed up at Alchemax talking about harnessing energy from the fourth dimension. Now he won't stop until he's running the place. I know his type. He's thinking beyond Alchemax, aiming towards who knows what. He's the exact type of corporate monster I've sworn to rein in. Especially if he's mucking with time travel. The year 2099 might not be much, but it's all mine. And he's not going to change it. He's been siphoning Alchemax resources into converting the gateway and the old virtual unreality lab into something else. Something dangerous. I've tried talking to him, but he's got no time for Miguel O'Hara. But people make time for Spider-Man. Just use the convenient access to the ventilation system to get inside, and then Walker and I can have a little chat. Whatever Sloane's up to, I've got to shut it down before he gets in over his head and drags everyone and everything down with him. See, they've been keeping busy in the cybernetics division. Well, it's a lot of shocking robots down there. During the day, as Miguel O'Hara, Alchemax geneticist, I could have walked right in. But at night, the security protocols kick in. The genetics lab. Without that department, I wouldn't be the man I am today. Sloane's got to be around here somewhere. I just know it. I think the largest tech developer in the world could afford to carpet their air ducts for extra comfort. Holographic Assistant, online. How may I serve you, Mr. Sloan? Hello, Joseph. Run a final check and initiate security bioscans. Preparing systems, Mr. Sloan. This won't take long. Bioscan sequence initiated. Access to time research lab granted, Mr. Sloan. Slow down, Miguel. Take your time. Don't want to get caught here. Alchemax should be thanking me. Stark Fujikawa Industries is going to take over this entire corporation. Unless someone steps up to it. You're the only one who thinks outside the box enough to do it, sir. Yes, Joseph, I know. I knew he was up to something. I'm 
almost embarrassed it took me so long to come up with it. I simply go back in time and launch Alchemax years before it was originally founded. Not only can I remake Alchemax in my image, but you can dismantle Stark Fujikawa before it gets started. You're a genius, sir. I programmed you well, Joseph. get away from me that easily. Of course the CEO will want me to have that degree of power. He's all about power, but he won't have anything to say about it by the time I'm done. Heading for his time research lab, all right. There's an access point near the generator. Am I the only newspaper man in the city that realizes what a menace that webhead is? Oh, uh, Jonah, um, indoor voice, okay? I'm trying to get Mary Jane on the phone. People lionizing that freak. Next thing you know, there'll be a musical about him with a chorus line of dancing Spider-Man. I'd pay to see that. Oh, Mary Jane, hi. see a show. Uh, MJ, I, I would love to, but I'm working with Dr. Octavius in the genetics lab on a DNA project. I had to download a sample of my own DNA into the permanent Alchemax genetic files. I'm still waiting for some test results. Permanent files, huh? Great, so a hundred years from now we can clone you. <laughs> yeah, I don't think so. Well, how about I come there and we grab a late dinner afterward, okay, Tiger? Yeah, sure, it's okay. Anything for you, babe. And I love when you call me Tiger. It's like a blast from the past. did it. That lunatic actually did it. And I saw it all. Intruder in time research lab. Maximum force can be used. Now great. Robot sentries. I'm not sure I can take them right now. Maybe I can draw them off. Move fast enough to distract them with some decoys. Peter. Peter Parker. Who's that? Who's talking? Miguel O'Hara, the Spider-Man from 2099. Are, are the other me's in my head, too? No. It's just me and you, old-timer. I threw together a chronal link program using a sample of your DNA. It's allowing me to communicate with you at the point in time it was taken. I just wish it was from earlier on. We have almost no time. Time until what? Until you're killed. Un 
And tell him what now? Because it kind of sounded like you said kill. Listen, a lunatic named Walker Sloan from 2099 created a time gateway. It was a one-way trip that dumped him sometime in the 1970s. He then used his advanced knowledge to build Alchemax, years before it was supposed to be established, transforming your world and mine. But I work for Alchemax. You're saying that's somehow wrong? Completely. At this point in time, you earn a living taking news pictures for J. Jonah Jameson. <laughs> the the late-night ranting TV news guy? <laughs> forget it. You can't forget it. Where does this so-called death happen? Sloan's building another gateway on the 66th floor, so he can finally travel back and forth. I saw you being killed, right there. By who? I couldn't make it out. It doesn't matter. Get out of the building! So a crazed killer can wander around the building without me to stop him? No way! Besides, if I find this guy somewhere else, then I'm invincible. Because I can only die at the gateway, right? It's not an exact science, Parker. Meaning what? You want to spend an hour getting a crash course on temporal physics? No? Then do what I say. <laughs> You've got a lot to learn about priorities, pal. I'm gonna do what I think is right, and that means going after bad guys. You want a Spider-Man who'll do whatever you want? Go play a video game. What's that? spider sense. <laughs> Rock? Anti-Venom? He's the one gunning for me? But he's reformed! Hostile intruder detected in Sector AC-78. I've got the intruder sight. Are there teleporting guards in? That's spiffy new tech. All employees, we are in a state of total security. We apologize for any inconvenience or possible loss of life. Thank you. Wait, what did you say? I can't hear you. We need to work out the kinks of this time travel communications thing if it's gonna have any hope of catching on. Parker, focus on what's important. I am, which is why I'm heading up to the 66th floor. If that's where we're supposed to butt heads, maybe I could draw them out en route. I'm gonna go look for an elevator. Do you want to die? Of course not. But I want to run away even less. and just changed into a closet. Huh. Rock just tried to kill me with an elevator. Weird coincidence. Maybe not. Wait, 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 wait. Something I did here had an effect on you in 2099? That's impossible. Well, theoretically, it's not. The idea is called quantum causality. The two gateways created a link between our times. Like a wormhole through the fourth dimension. Right. Normally changing the past just creates an alternate timeline. But thanks to the wormhole, what you do there affects my time, and vice versa. So I can change things here, now, that can immediately change things in the future? That's amazing! Spectacular, even! The security system has all the entrances blocked. I gotta come back here after I take out the security mainframe. Parker, my path to the 66th floor is blocked by some kind of force field. Welcome to my world. Thank you for shopping, Alphamax. Do come again. I'm about to destroy the security mainframe. How you doing, O'Hara? You still stuck? Yeah. Now listen and learn, newbie. Ta -da! That's all both of problems, right? My force field just changed into centuries. Robot guards! This whole quantum causality thing is a real wild card. I can't control if it makes things better or worse. Well, at least I can get through the door now. This is getting absurd. All units converge. So, this quantum causality, could it run both ways? Affecting my time as well as yours? Impossible. Because it's happening. All the bad guys just froze. Yeah, and by that I mean it's possible. Wow. 
You're holding back, Eddie. You realize this time travel story of yours is gonna cost me my job. It's not your job. It's not even your reality. Yeah, that's what you keep saying. But how do you know? Because I do! And deep down, so do you! Now let me concentrate. I have my own problems right now. Yeah, well, I can't help you with that. Maybe you can. Parker, you're making this harder for me, not easier. I told you trying to control this quantum causality thing was a stupid idea. They said penicillin was stupid, too. You're talking about the fabric of reality, not Breadmull. Just get ready to help me. Breadmull! Sheesh. I cannot believe his crust. There. The elevator I need is right at the end of this hallway. Parker, I'm in a jam and you put me there. Hey, I was having a quiet evening until you started talking inside my head. Don't blame me for this. All right, fine. What do you need me to do? O'Hara? Great. He's gone. Parker! Stop screwing around and get me out of this! I'm not a time travel expert. How do I... Wait, 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 wait. What if I just trash the robotic research facility? Is that worth a try? Anything's worth a try! Stop yelling at me! I'm just learning about this whole quantum causality thing. Learn faster! Okay, I'm there. I'll destroy the prototype parts and we'll see what happens. At least one of us will! man's life is depending on a theory. Believe it! You still with me, O'Hara? Faster! Faster would be better! I'm doing my best! Best! Not good enough! No! O'Hara! O'Hara, there's nothing left here to trash. You still there? For the most part. Do they turn into something else? Like, I don't know, kittens? Yeah. Small, metal, robotic, killer kittens. Aww. Thanks for getting me out of there. Kind of proves the quantum causality theory. Well, just tell me who wins the next ten World Series. Who call it even? The world what? You're killing me, O'Hara. I'm not. But you will if you go to the 66th floor. 66th floor, I know. And we both know I'll do what I have to do. Okay, fine. If plan A, keeping you out of danger isn't working, then we'll go for plan B. I'll get down to my own 66 floor and see if we can solve this thing. I'll try not to die. Max isn't kidding around. Parker, slow down. Wait for me to get to my 66th floor. Instead of my slowing, how about you hurry? Ah, figures. Parker, a hallway here just changed. Wasn't me. Maybe Brock will smash the wall or something. I'm just trying to stay alive. If you were, you'd clear out. But you have to prove your bravery. Bravery? Dude, there is nothing I would like better than to just hightail it out of here. Then why the shock don't? Because what I do yeah. here matters, okay? Beyond changing hallways into elevators, it matters. And that's just something I have to live with, even if it means I die with it. You get it, O'Hara?
Yeah, of course. There's no security pass on them. Why should anything be easy? There's got to be a key pass around here. Where are you? Nearly where you don't want me to be. Slow down, would you? How about you speed up? Yeah, I'll get right on that. Only way to move fast enough is to go free fall in the elevator shaft. Shortest distance between two points is a straight line. On my way, Parker. Parker? Well, that's ominous. Reaches his own 66th floor ahead of me. Parker, you hanging in there? Oh, sure. Hanging, crawling, leaping, all part of the service. And you can stop worrying about me, Mommy, especially since I'm the one who keeps having to bail you out. I'll keep worrying until this is done. How close are you to the 66th floor? Parker? Shut up. I just spotted Rock. I'll be in touch. Parker! Parker, are you. Oh, I've got to wrap this thing up before it turns into an even bigger disaster than it already is. At least there's an alternate route. It'll slow me, but I can still get to the 66th floor. Supplying backup as required. Sixty-six floor. Where are you? Is this Anti Venom still hiding? I'm face to face to face with Anti Venom. Eddie, you're responsible for the explosions. Trying to blow you up. If you were really trying, you'd have done it. What's going on? Kill you now. What's happening there, Parker? Anti-Venom's fighting himself more than he is me. Subcutaneous control chips would do the job. How dangerous is this guy? He drains my powers on contact, and he's invisible to my spider sense. Terrific. But where are you now, and can you avoid Anti-Venom? 66th floor, and yeah, maybe I could avoid him. Plus, if his explosions bring the building down, people for blocks around will be killed. Gotta find a way to get Eddie Brock free of whatever's controlling him. There you are. Eddie, you're being controlled. Fight it. Fight you instead. He took off again. Yeah, if only you'd do the same. O'Hara, if you don't get that I can't turn my back on danger, no matter what the cost, then you've got no business calling yourself Spider-Man. Wow, I'm hurt. Guess what else I am? Still alive. Let's hope you get to keep saying the same thing. We've been a lot of things to each other, Eddie, but you've never been anyone's patsy. Oh, good. Stand there and call him names. Great plan. Sure, so scarce. Eddie, listen. You've got a chip inside you that's making you do this. Just making it easier. The longer that thing's in you, the more it's rewiring your thinking. No. 
know it's a cat! Parker, what are you doing? Because it's causing major problems here. I've got to get the atomic energy regulators out of the way so they're not destroyed. So, I'm in danger of frying from radiation because I... Of explosions on your end? Hey, you're the one who told me about quantum causality. Yeah, well, now I'm telling you to fix this. Sheesh, what a grouch. Okay, O'Hara, the first regulator's safe. The radiation level is dropping, but my costume's providing me some protection from it, but it's not gonna last forever. And just give me a minute to take care of the other two regulators. I mean, it's about all I have. It's blacked out from that. I've gotten the second regulator to safety. Is it still affecting things on your end? Yeah, it, it's still dropping, but the cumulative effect, if it's not stopped entirely. That body part started falling off yet? No, I'm still in one. Yet. Are you planning to make this go away or not? You know, you gotta learn to lighten up. I'll take care of the last one, everything will be fine. <laughs> You're not the one who can send up as a human down. nightlight. Strength. I hate to admit it, but this quantum causality thing of yours is actually pretty effective. No, oh, glad you approve. You know, for something that makes no freaking sense at all. Back off, Eddie! You're a puppet! Fight the puppet master, not me! Difficult for me to... You don't know what you're doing! I know enough. You have to die. Or we both can live! You think... You're so much better than I am. Acting like you're so worried about me. I'm worried about what you'll do to other people. And yeah, to me. But if you can fight it... He can't. Trust me. Oh yeah, I always trust people who are trying to kill me. So you're the head lunatic. Well, we haven't been properly introduced. I'm the guy who's gonna stop your plans. Good luck with that. Anti-venom? Finish him. Can't! Can't. Impressive resistance, but activating all the control chips, releasing your more bestial side, should do the trick.
Eddie? We all done here? Huh. How about that? Miguel! Good news. Turns out you were wrong! Hope that doesn't wound your ego. What, you think if you die, I'll be happy to be right? Well, I don't think you're happy to be wrong! Well, then you know as little about me as you think I know about you. What I know is that Brock looks to be down for the count. Better make sure, though. So, can we call this one a wrap, Eddie? Maybe go grab some coffee, laugh about it? Okay, guess I can go back now and take out Sloan once and for all. Oh, damn, great, no spider sense. No, no. Ah! I'm trying to cure you. Go cure yourself. <sighs> nice try. Didn't work. Yes, it did. Now to finish the job. you is messing with your power. Fight it, Eddie. You're about to die. <sighs> Eddie, don't you get it? This is your chance to take back your mind. You can end this now. Yes, end this. Good. get to be right after all. Believe me, that's the last thing I want. Calm down, Ziggy. You're amazing. I'm about to reach the gateway room. And when you get there, then what? Don't worry. Yeah. Why would I? Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Parker, it's another time distortion blocking my way. <sighs> Don't blame me. I'm not blaming anyone. I need to find another way to the gateway room. Um, O'Hara, you uh, might want to get a move on. Just hold on a little longer. Are you kidding me? If Brock wasn't busy fighting what's controlling him, I'd be a blue and red splotch by now. Point taken. I'll hurry. complicated on my end, but I'm almost there. You still haven't told me what happens once you get there. The only thing I can think of is to go back to your time. Swell. We'll do lunch. Parker, you still with us? Not for much longer if Brock has anything to say about it. O'Hara, maybe I would have listened to you. You didn't keep saying shock all the time. Oh, no, you did listen. You just did what you had to do. I didn't think that I'd have to die for it. No, you won't! Trust me! We'll get you through this. Almost hitting you! That makes two of us.
try, Spider-Man, but I've had a hundred years to plan this. Keep your friends close and your enemies closer. I kept you close to keep an eye on you, make use of you. But now you're done, and I'm done with you. O'Hara, uh, a little help? O'Hara, if you're there, I got nothing left. No power, no, no nothing. You tried to warn me. I was an idiot. Stop talking about yourself in the past tense. This isn't over. Spoken like someone who isn't here. I will be. Just hold on. I'm doing what I can. Come on, Parker. No words that never say die attitude. I don't need to say it to do it. And I'm out of jokes. Sorry. I didn't get the job done. No way, no shocking way are you giving me brave last words! into the middle of Walker. I'm just a scientist for the love Stop of... Stop whining, Octavius. You knew I was out to change the future. I didn't know the future was going to start fighting back. The forces we're unleashing with this quantum tunnel... It's under control. It's out of control. And Spider-Man is still alive to stop it. We'll just send Anti-Venom after him. The gateway just needs a minute to recharge if it's going to send him through safely. step on this one. I don't understand. Why aren't Anti-Venom's powers draining his... Because mine are radiation-based, if you have to know. Didn't know. Don't care. You're just old news, A.V.
Miguel. There's some kind of monsters breaking in. Where'd they come from? Just keep calm. They're probably mutation experiments from other generation eggs in that lab. Most likely they'll want to eat you for raw materials. Good oh, thing you told me to stay calm. That makes it all better. I'll change things here to fix things there. Here? There? Wait, am I in 2099? Yeah, but if I destroy the regeneration eggs here, it'll eliminate the experiments there. Parker, do with me. Parker! Oh, oh, I'm sorry. Sitting on this egg, my mind's a little scrambled. I'm here, okay? Just hurry. I'm trying to break my head. It's hard to keep my sun side up. <sighs> Almost. And I'm so weak. Parker, tell me you're safe. Dude, just because I'm stuck in an egg doesn't mean I go over easy. Oh, boy. I'm going after anti-venom. You try not to get killed. Again. Spider-Man dead. You should be thanking me. Let me show you just how grateful I am! No! Keep back! One side, you fool! Before... Ah! Total cellular regeneration complete in three. Two, one. Free generation complete. You are fully healed, Mr. Parker. Room spinning. I can barely stand. Where am I? You're in 2099, Parker. The cellular regenerator healed you. Uh, I hope my medical insurance covers that. Look, focus, Parker. We have to test the gateway. Toss something small into it. Oh, come on, where? Doesn't coming back from the dead entitle me to a breather? I... We need to see if the gateway's re-established. In every second the... Okay, 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 fine. I'm on it. I'm gonna toss a piece of junk to see if the gate's working one way. Incoming! Came through. Perfect. Huh. Plus, I'm feeling like my old self. Strength and everything. Yeah, well, it's a good thing the cellular regenerator had your DNA on record. Good. Stand back. Uh, what do you mean? I'm coming through the gateway. Wait, the return circuits are fried. I won't be able to come through even if you set it up on that end. I'll be stuck here. So fix it. I can't. The technology doesn't exist here yet. You need to find the repair parts on your side and then send them through. I'll guide you to where they are. What the heck is that? What happened? I'm looking at a tentacle the size of a Buick. Yeah, something like that came at me when the gateway first got overloaded. It looked like one of those mechanical tentacles that Otto Octavius uses in his research. Really messed up. Look, just watch out for them. There may be more. Oh, believe me, whatever's trying to kill me at any time, there's always more. So where to? Get to the hydroponic jungle. You'll find what you need there. These freaking tentacles keep showing up! Well, that's interesting. I am so glad you can maintain your scientific detachment. And why are time gateway repair parts in a jungle? Just trust me, okay? 
Trust me, says the voice in my head. You know, this is how serial killers get started. The claw end of the tentacle, where the joints are. That's probably the weak point. When you acquire the parts, keep them separated. Otherwise, you can wind up with a sort of energy feedback. Okay, what sort do you mean? The explosive sort. Oh, fantastic. By the way, thanks for bringing me back from the dead. Now I know how Captain America feels. And Jean Grey. And Colossus. And... Just don't die again and we'll call it even. O'Hara! What just happened? What is that? What are you talking about? I have a nice easy path in front of me and it just became an obstacle course. <laughs> Welcome to my world, literally. You're seeing quantum causality in action. Weird. So, you can help me from the present. Uh, which present? You're in my present. You mean your past present or my present future? I hate you. Okay, I'm almost there. Now what? Okay, there are three rooms in the hydro jungle. You'll find an energy regulator in each one. Take the part that looks like an atomic battery. Atomic? It'll be fine, as long as you remember that they're fragile. And if they touch you... And if they touch each other, I'm screwed. I get it. The part you need should be in the middle of the room. You can take it without risk after you deactivate the three consoles around the room. Why are these things always threes? I have no idea. You know, that's just gonna bug me now for the rest of the day. taking bows. Those tentacles started showing up here in force. Yeah, yeah, I'm on it. Security lasers. Again. Hit the switches to open the door. It's easy enough. She says you. Oh, and by the way, thanks for putting me in this fix. We're both in. Yeah, but I'm the Wii dodging lasers. starting to look like the Sahara. That couldn't be helped. The parts are rare and we need them more than a bunch of plants. Oh, damn it! O'Hara, the suicide is back and it just annihilated my way out. Or maybe not. It looks like it just opened up a different path. I hope you're being careful with the parts. Uh, uh O'Hara? Remember you said to keep those parts separate? Well, let's just say, uh, just for the sake of argument, that didn't work out. Just how big a bang are we talking about? It would crater the city. Why are you asking? Wait, don't tell me. Is there any way to reverse it? Not for you, there isn't. Get him to the gateway as fast as you can. <gasps> More tentacles. I can't get past them in time. That sounds like a sewer in here. Better keep moving. My, my, my. A blast from the past. Such an active little spider. Brings back so many memories. You aren't supposed to be here, you know. That voice. That voice. It sounds like... No, it could be. The security system has told me you're here. And you've been very, very naughty. But you just keep running around spinning your webs, little spider. I'll be right with you, so we can relive old times. <sighs> Must be the speakers distorting it. 
By the way, who built speakers into sewers anyway? What's up with that? I'm in the gateway room. All right, throw the parts through, one at a time. Passing them through the energy stream should reverse the energy buildup, but if you toss them in all together, it'll trigger the... Okay, okay, I get it. We got any clue why Otto's tentacles keep coming out of nowhere? He may still be alive between the men are trying to get out. Or drag us in. I wish I knew how to get rid of these shocking tentacles. Have you got the new parts in place? Yeah, I just have to activate the breakers. Good plan. Without getting killed. Ooh, better plan. You're done. What are you doing? I'm activating the breakers. Just hold on. Press myself. Don't hurry. I'm thinking of staying here. Good. Are you out of your... Okay, let me just finish this and we'll talk. getting a steady power flow. I need to find the schematics to figure out why. But the archives room here is in the same place it is in my time. It should be accessible through a vertical tunnel. You stay put. I've been thinking maybe staying put isn't such a bad idea. Meaning what? Come on, O'Hara. It's not like anti-venom was a fluke. Someone's always trying to kill me, and there's always a chance of my loved ones being caught in the crossfire. If I stay here, no one I love will suffer or die because of me. What about all the good you've done? And will do? The people you'll inspire, including me. You're saying the lives of a billion strangers are more important than my loved ones? I'm not saying that. History says that. Yeah, well, history doesn't have to wrestle with guilt. <sighs> or tentacles. They're at it again. All right, stay clear of them. I'll get it figured out on my end. O'Hara, oh, if you're working with the tentacles to convince me that 2099 sucks, then mission accomplished. Anxious to come home? Well, so am I. Almost to the archives. Almost won't stop these freaking tentacles! Reboot the gateway, would you please? Working on it. Oh, terrific. A voice-coded door. Uh, Miguel O'Hara, 5249. Access denied. <laughs> 
figures. Parker, change in plan. Cancel, please. I can't access the archives on this end, but you can on yours. I'll guide you to the archive room, and you can give me the information I need. The archives room? That would be handy. I could look up the people I love and keep them out of danger. Don't you dare poke around in there, Parker. You've already seen the dangers of screwing with the past. Learn from the mistakes instead of repeating them. Uh, fine, fine. Find the architectural plans. Make some changes, but I'll need a computer for that. Then find one! smelled like a rhino in July. Oh, Hera, they have enough security in here to keep out an army of Spider-Man. Any ideas? I'm trying something here. Did it work? Uh, yeah, mostly. I can deal with the rest. Thanks, O'Hara. Moving on to the next item on our agenda. Good. Now focus. Get the schematics we need. If you run into trouble, I can make modifications from here to simplify your path. Bad guys have all the luck. Yeah, I'm stuck again. I'm blocked by a security field. Can you do anything for me? It looks like the security matrix is in the adjacent room. I'm rerouting a vent to you so you can destroy it. Thanks, I'm on my way to the archives. I'm sure I'll be fine from here on out. Just hurry. These shock and tentacles are getting nastier by the minute. On my way! Another security matrix. Great. Okay, the force field should be down by now. Pleasant dreams!
little bug before you get squashed. Bet you can't handle this. <laughs> oh, her again? Please let me be wrong about who this is. How do you think it's going? Just tell me when you're on your way to the archives. Yep, at least the place still looks the same. Well, the same, but, you know, different. <laughs> this is screwy. One down. the archives. I need access to the other floor so I can get all the keys I need for the classified database. I'll do what I can, but these tentacles are making life pretty shocking difficult. Okay, how's that? It's a start. I can get to the second floor. I'll let you know when I need the others. Almost done. Just one more. I need access to those other floors now. No, of course, Your Highness. I'll get right on that. Just hold your webs a sec, okay? And voila! Now get that key and access the computer. Sir, yes, sir. Here, so how do I access it? Enter my password. Lila. L-Y-L-A. Access denied. How oh, great. You got any other ideas? Well, let me think. Oh, I wish I could just say open sesame or grant me access or... Request acknowledged. Access granted. That was weird. Okay, let's go over the starter procedures. Slow down, Parker. It's not that simple. Did you fire up the quark enhancers? Activate the tachyon relays? Yes, yes, I did all that. No, you just... Uncouple the Heisenberg compensators. Yes, of course I... Oh, shuck it, no, I didn't. I was right? <laughs> wow. I... Oh, no. What's wrong? It's Mary Jane. She dies. Tonight. Right there at Alchemax. H how do you know... For shock's sake, Parker, what part of Don't Poke Around in the Archives was unclear? Fine, I'm a nosy Parker, but now that I've found out, it's... It's what? My job to save her? I've got enough to deal with. You can't mean that. You can't just ignore that she's in danger. Hey, I'm trying to focus on what's important. What's important is not standing by and allowing someone to suffer or die because you do nothing. If you don't get that, then you don't get the first thing about being Spider-Man. You're the one who doesn't get it, Parker. The future depends on- My future is meaningless without her. This is gonna be a huge mistake. I owe you, Miguel. Big time. Shock and right you do. But, well, maybe this'll help even the score for everything the world owes you. Thank you. I mean that. Man, I'm 
must have been crazy to think about staying here. If people I love are going to be in danger, then I need to be there to help them. Oh, now what? It is her. And what's Mary Jane look like, anyway? Tall, redhead, in mortal danger. I'm sure you can find her. What's she doing in Alchemax? Does she work here? Uh, no, she was just meeting up with me. We were going out together. This is all my fault. Calm down. My set will take care of it. Shouldn't be hard to find. I see her, and she's looking for you. It's my fault she's there. Is she safe? Well, she's not dead, but the tentacles have other ideas. Help her for crying out loud! Mary Jane, head toward the sound of my voice! Mary Jane! Wait! Oh, thank you! Wait! Who are you?! I don't care, just help me! Mary Jane! Oh, shock. She's dead, isn't she? Hurry, O'Hara! I'm doing my best. I've got my own problems. Don't talk to me about problems. Calm down. No. Why? Seconds ago, the computer said she was crushed by some kind of falling debris. Now it says she dies in... No, wait, it's changing again. It's the quantum causality, Peter. There's so much happening that it's going haywire. Now calm down. I have enough to deal with without you freaking out in my head. Okay. Okay. What is this? What's going on? Trying to keep it together, Miguel. Just tell me something. I'm trying to find her. Temporal rifts are opening all over. It's like the fabric of space time is being stretched thinner and thinner. It may reach a point where it's irreparable. The universe doesn't end while I'm trying to save one person. Mary Jane, over here! That woman needs her shock and hearing checked. And if I stop to fight these things, there may not be anything of her left to save. Peter sent me. He did?
actually nothing. What does that mean? Honestly, that means she wasn't important enough to be remembered. You got some sort of cell phone under that mask? A cell what? I mean, uh, sure. That's it. Uh, can I...? You'll have plenty of time to talk to him after all this is over. You'll have your whole lives together. Look, I just want to say... Thank you. You're as brave and unselfish as... Another guy who goes by the handle Spider-Man. You're a worthy successor to the name. Thanks. I mean that. Thanks again, Miguel. Enough with the thanks. You ready? Come home? You bet. And leave me again? How much rejection is a girl supposed to take? Black Cat? I was praying I was wrong. Felicia? What if they... Help me, Spider. They, they gave me an anti-aging drug. For decades. Made me over. Spider sense going nuts. You're lying. The real Felicia, she would have never let them... Never let them what? Turn me into this? You destroyed me, Spider. After what you did, I didn't care what happened to me. I don't know what you're talking about. Either I haven't done yet what you claim I did, or you're making this up to mess with my head. And you get to guess which one. Isn't this fun? Not remotely. Aw, you used to have a sense of humor. Dying tends to get you serious and hurt. Then you're about to get deadly serious. You really gonna do this, Felicia? You never could be, me, Cat. Yeah, you'll make us look bad. Don't you wish you had a clown? It ends here, Felicia. I'm so sorry. Oh, he's so sorry. Help me, Spider, poor me! You actually fell for that. What's we ever see in him? Felicia, this creature isn't you! <laughs> you don't get to lecture us on who we are, Spider. Not anymore. Okay, Peter, I'm almost to the gateway. Energy is limited, so we'll have to jump through at the same time. Don't worry, I'll be there. to the gateway room. Tell me when you're there as well. We have to time this right. You got it, Miguel. <laughs> oh, how nice. You and your counterpart are on a first-name basis now. It's good to know you've bonded. Who are you? I'm the CEO of Alchemax. The real question is, who are you, old friend? Old friend? So this is where you make the big reveal, and I say, holy cow, Norman Osborn, or the Kingpin, Jonah Jameson. Come on, please be Jameson. <sighs> All of them long dead, I fear. Too bad they didn't have access to the anti-aging drug we developed. It does wonders for you. And I do mean you. No, it, it can't be. It can't be, yes. Why do people always say that? Good thing your future counterpart saved us, eh? 
Otherwise, we couldn't be... this. I... I become the evil mastermind? Oh, don't be melodramatic. With great power comes great responsibility. And great opportunity. And the only way to live up to all that responsibility is to use every opportunity to get all the power. I learned that the day I lost everyone I loved and didn't have the power to stop it. What do you mean, everyone? You'll find out. Except once I've fixed reality, you actually won't find out. Consider yourself lucky. Peter, it's up and running, but it's not tremendously stable. Where are you? I think, I think I'm in hell. The CEO, it's me. What? That's, that's insane. How can that be? Holy shock! Peter, now, move, move! Let me explain it all to you. Explain it to my rapidly retreating backside. Peter, get a move on. I'm going as fast as I can. I can't let it, let me end up this way. This is no time for a soliloquy, Peter. I'm barely holding the gateway together. I'm barely holding myself together. Access granted, Mr. Parker. What now? Huh. This is weird. I can't let this happen. I have to get home and do something about it. What you're looking for. You know it is. Well, then come and get it. Peter, are you on your way? Yeah, um, slight setback. What kind? My ex wants to play cat and mouse. Uh, this is serious. Well, it wasn't my idea. It, just do what you have to do and get to the gateway. Did you make 
make it through? Yeah, but something came through with me. Oh my god. What's wrong? Those tentacles! They were coming from some kind of... I, I don't know what this atrocity is. In fact, that's what I'm gonna call it. Atrocity. Because big scary tentacle monster thingy takes way too long to say. How oh, that and Bing Bing Boom was taken. Peter, again. Focus. The quantum bridge is building on itself. Like a hurricane. It's a massive time storm. And if we can't get it under control, it's gonna wipe out everything. You know how to solve this, right? The time storm and this atrocity that followed me out? This is a little out of my field, okay? The Parascience boys would be better. Hey, that's it. The Parascience Research Lab. Best bet for all the answers. I'll go there. The time storm is starting to tear everything apart. Ditto here. Not to mention I'm playing tag with this crazy Octo Monster. I don't believe it. A transitional Einstein Rosen bridge. You mean a wormhole? Uh, yeah. As crazy as it sounds, I can use it to get to the Parascience Research Lab faster. Watch your step! The causality's out of control! Was it ever in control? The point is, if you breathe wrong, it could have unexpected consequences. So watch it! Yeah, I'll do my best to watch my step while I'm fighting for my life. Are you shocking kidding me? What did I just tell you? It's not my fault the atrocity took out a wall with his tentacles, okay? Well, be careful! I'm being careful! Tell him to be careful! Power's out. There has to be a backup generator somewhere. Looks like an old DNA card. I wonder if I can get it to work by locking it into this station. information so I can shut this insanity down. Peter, I think that atrocity is connected to the time storm somehow. 
What I really need is some of its DNA to complete the analysis. How? It's on this end. Grab a DNA recorder and acquire a sample. Download it into a computer there, and it'll show up here. But if it's not already there, doesn't that mean I've failed? You want a two-hour lecture on the laws of quantum dynamics? No? Then trust me, it won't be visible here until you do it there. Oh, time travel makes my head hurt. So I've got to grab a DNA recorder from the genetics lab. It's not a rare item. You shouldn't have too much trouble finding it. I've got Tentacle Boy after me. Nothing's a walk in the park right now. Point taken. It was practically right next door. That's probably it over there. Easy peasy. Talk about urban renewal. I should have seen that coming. And who the heck are you supposed to be? The Walker's gonna kill you. Oh, welcome to the club. They're having jackets made. What are you, a uh, Septuple XL? Okay, okay, if I were a DNA recorder, where would I be hiding? Look, as long as you're there, would you mind giving him a quick wash? I'm betting he can't get through those panels. If I could just shut them. Aside from not having a DNA recorder and being chased by Berserk Sushi, just sweat. Well, get it in gear, because if this time storm escalates, you're gonna have a ringside seat for a brand new Big Bang. I'll get the DNA then. I'm moving as fast as I can. Well, move faster. I hate it when he says that. about your corporate glass ceilings. I hope this one holds up. That air duct looks like the only way out. Gotta go. Thank God it held up. That thing had broken through, but I had me. Now the air duct? What's next? to tear free. Left half my costume behind, but it was worth it. Found a room to hide in, passed out. Where are you now? 
I'm not sure. Let me check. Oh, finally! Miguel, I found it! The DNA recorder? Yes! But don't stand around telling me about it. Use it! On the atrocity! Love this plan. <laughs> Gotta maneuver him into the gas chamber. Come on, atrocity. That's a good little atrocity. DNA strands integrated. Oh, no wonder I couldn't get a read. That thing's a combination of Sloan, Octavius, and Antivenom. They must have mutated into that thing when they were shoved through. My god. Any weaknesses? At a guess? High voltage. Right now, they're supercharged with quantum particles. If we can reverse the polarity of the gateway and shove it back through, the quantum feedback could reverse the time storm. Why reverse it, Miguel, when we can use it? You know who I... Of course. He knows, so I know. Miguel, you're on the wrong side of this. I'm not the villain here. I'm the guy who's trying to make everything right. Don't you get it? Uh, apparently I don't. When the storm is fully unleashed, I'm going to harness the quantum energy. It will give me complete control over the time stream. Complete con What are you trying to play, God? The first creation of the universe wasn't bad. For a first draft. I'm just going to provide a much needed rewrite. I can make up for my original sin by saving Uncle Ben. Not to mention Gwen Stacy, her dad, countless others. What kind of villain fixes it so that everyone gets to live happily ever after? You're talking about power no human should have. You'll end up destroying yourself, but not before you've annihilated everything else. Well then, I guess we'll just have to agree to disagree. This discussion is over. It's over when I say it's over! The CEO 
Del and I have some unfinished business. Hmm. This thing has a gravity reversal system to separate out precious metals. I can use that to get the shock back up there. Not excellent. I'm gonna have to reroute more power and overload it to get the upward boost I need. Now, there must be some reserve power banks around here somewhere. I can climb the debris to get higher. Alright, now to trigger a disposal cycle that'll reverse the gravity and get me up to the next level. Bad idea. It'll be the last I ever have. Okay, you raving megalomaniac. Here I come. Get ready for round two. Lab, Mikael. Don't worry, I'm all over this. Peter, these failed freaks are piling on. You sure you can do this? I'm almost to the lab. Piece of cake. This is no time for pastries. Okay, I took out a bunch of them. Any improvement on your end? Some, yeah. Keep it going. No problem. my own problems. Where it began, that's where we'll end it. We're thinking alike. It took long enough. That did the trick. Miguel, I'm in the time research lab. It's probably in lockdown mode. Yep, that would be the old Parker luck. Yep, locked. 
perfect. Need a pass key if I'm gonna get through that door to the gateway. Hey, hall monitor, give me a pass. Oh, you gotta be kidding. Now I gotta what, go in after him? I think I found some sort of prototype, but non-working model. The cars are real enough. Is that Miguel? Any chance that prototype is functional? How the shock would I know? Well, you're Mr. Future Knowledge and everything. I figured maybe you'd know why a guy just disappeared into it with the pass I need, no less. Disappeared? Huh. It might be another operational gateway, or it might be a simple matter transmitter device. Simple? A toaster is simple. A matter transmitter's a little more complicated. If you say so, what's a toaster? What's a to- Oh, never mind. me back where I came from. before he starts draining quantum energy. Or who knows what could happen? All right, here it is. The CEO's tower. I'm coming for you, boss. Miguel, I've been thinking about the CEO. Yeah, me too. Okay, listen, don't even bother trying to get at him from behind. His spider sense gives him the edge. But Captain America once told me that I put too much into my combo attacks and leave myself open for a few moments after them. I know I shouldn't, but I do. Thanks, I'll do that. Oh well, just don't let the bad guys know. Still hiding behind your metal bodyguards? You've gone soft after all these decades. Face it, you're a gutless coward, Peter Parker. Uh, excuse me? Dude, what the hell? I didn't mean you, I, I meant future you. It was nothing personal. Uh, it kinda was. I mean, yeah, take him down. Try not to piss off the superpowered corporate lunatic more than you have, you know? Fair enough. I really didn't want it to come to this. I guess it was inevitable, though. I mean, talk about your boss fights, right? What happened to you, Parker? You used to be the greatest of them all. <laughs> I still am, Sport. The one, the only, Spider-Man. Except no substitutes, including you. You have to listen to reason. No, I really don't. That's one of the joys of being in charge. So if you want to make this personal, you can join me in the gateway room. I'm about to end this. <laughs> the older you is some piece of work. Why? What happened? meeting up in the gateway room. I'm really starting to hate that place. But, like you said, it began there, and it's gonna end there. Miguel! I'm getting ready to reverse the polarity. But, uh, just in case I blow up the universe, I just want to tell you, it's been fun. Have faith! I'm almost positive this will work!
much. Then try cutting loose a tentacle. Wait, we can do that? Worth the try. Pleasant dreams. I cleared my schedule for you. I'm sorry it's come to this, but obviously you're part of the problem, not the solution. I was watching the space-time continuum collapse. Any kind of solution? Idiot. I'm absorbing all the quantum particles being unleashed. I'll reshape the timeline any way I wish long before it collapses. Think of it as playing dice with the universe. Einstein would have approved. Einstein's not here, so I guess I'll have to do. Now you're just embarrassed. Peter, looks like your future self took a page from Iron Man's old playbook. I'm squaring off against some kind of iron spider outfit. That sounds like a crutch to me. If he really had confidence in his own speed and agility, he wouldn't be making with the heavy metal. At least make it a challenge. of yours? Um, yeah. I'm just full of surprises. He doesn't know about atrocity. I can use them, especially the anti-venom part. I, I don't understand this. How are those things draining my powers? How? As quickly as possible. That's how. You can't get away. Let's settle this right now! You can't win, you know.
down to this. I tried to warn you, we 
Angel. I really do. You've no one to blame but yourself. Maybe the most merciful thing to do is just wipe you out of existence entirely. I just both some aggravation. Okay, but if the timeline snapped back to normal, if none of it happened, how do you and I remember? I mean, we've got two different sets of memories in our brains. Shouldn't that be making us, I don't know, crazy? <laughs> crazy? We already dress in skin-tight costumes and fight bad guys for free. Okay, crazy-er. You really want a five-hour lecture on temporal paradoxes? Sure, why not? As it turns out, looks like I have all the time in the world. first major theoretical studies were done by Reed Richards, which, since you know personally, is rather ironic. Yeah, that's not really ironic. That's just coincidental. Irony is something completely different. You're correcting my word use now? Is that what it's come to? No harm in being accurate. Okay, fine. Coincidentally, Reed Richards did the first studies, which hypothesized that time is like a vortex. And when major changes occur in the surrounding vortex, anyone who is dead center of the disruption can observe them without being affected, like being in the eye of a storm. He called it the observer effect. It sounds kind of dry. Ooh, how about Armageddon syndrome? How about Armageddon out of here? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Bad puns, totally my thing. <laughs> you don't own puns. They're not your thing. They're a thing. Well, maybe if you would just explain it right. You're from the future. You're supposed to have all these cool time things. Maybe you should just talk faster. I don't know. Uh, yeah, this is going to take way longer than five hours.